welcome back to Morning Cup. Today we are making an amazing dish that is so simple, so easy. It is quinoa, which is the first thing we're gonna start with. And then we're also gonna be adding other ingredients to it, but I'm right now boiling about three cups of water. And now I'm gonna do one cup of quinoa. A wooden spoon to mix it up. And then I'm gonna let it simmer for 15 minutes. We just moved over the quinoa, and now we have a skillet. I already put some avocado oil in it, and I just put the temperature high. The next ingredient is gonna be chickpeas. So I already drained the water out. That's broccoli, cauliflower, and carrots. Now I'm just gonna mix this in. And then I'm gonna let it simmer a little bit. And then in about five minutes or so, I'm just gonna stir it again to make sure it's cooking. Hey guys, it's been about five minutes, so I'm just gonna open this up, mix it around. You can still see it's a little bit frozen. So we just want to make sure all the veggies are getting heated up. So you can see the quinoa is almost done. It has about two minutes left. And you can see it's almost ready. So we're going to close that up until it is ready. And then when we come over here, we're just going to check. And it has about two more minutes left as well. Okay. So now the timer's going to go off in a few seconds. And stir it around a little bit. See right here, we have um, to drain it. I normally will do it over the sink, but I sh to show you guys, it has the bowl right there. And I'm pouring it in through the strainer. And to get any of the last remaining water, you're just gonna shake it up. All right, so now that it's drained, you are just gonna pour it into a bowl. Since the veggies were frozen, we are going to use a colander to strain it and just shake it up again. Okay, so now we're going to get a big bowl and I'm going to put the quinoa in there. And then the, all the veggies as well as the chickpeas because we're going to make it a protein bowl. So you have all of those together. We're going to add some spices to add some flavor to it. Turmeric is really good for pain or fighting inflammation. All the health benefits you can read online about it. And then we're just gonna mix it up. You are ready to serve. Bon appetit. <laughs> 